We have gathered here to witness and celebrate the union of Maria and James. In the years that they have been together, their love for each other has grown, turning them into the couple you see before you. Now they are ready to spend the rest of their lives together as husband and wife. Since day one, there was never any second guessing. From the moment you both met, there was an instant connection. There was no need to look any further because you were both all in. Thank you so much for coming to celebrate the marriage of my son, Jimmy, and his new bride, Maria. I'll always cherish the moment that Jimmy was born, watching him grow and becoming the man he is today. How the years have flown by, and here we are celebrating his wedding. Jimmy, you have definitely found your perfect match. You're the best friends. You both compliment each other, and I know you'll have a loving marriage. May today be the start of a long and happy life together. Congratulations. I love you both. Maria, welcome to our family. I've seen firsthand the joy you bring into my daughter's life. That's why I know today I don't lose a daughter. On the contrary, today I gain a son. I remember specifically sitting at Northern Seoul and uh, James telling me about this wonderful lady that he had met, and he was just absolutely enthralled. Maria is definitely a shining light and ball of energy that feeds greatly into this crew. So you absolutely amplify James, and you two meeting is like the best thing that happened. Lay <laughs> down. So I mentioned the Jeep earlier. Jimmy and Maria, I see you two taking turns driving that Jeep on life's journey together. And I think you're ready for any twists and turns in the road as, as things go on. James, desde que llegaste a la vida de María Emilia, pude notar lo bien que le hace tu amor y el amor que hoy hay entre ustedes. Me siento tranquilo poder entregarte en este momento Les deseo una vida llena de felicidad y bendiciones no en esta nueva etapa de sus vidas. I'd like to conclude this toast from one of my favorite New York Times bestselling authors, Aletha Romig. You don't marry the person you can live with, you marry the person that you can't live without. And that's exactly what we're witnessing today. When my daughter talks about you, she does it with so much love. And she always says, Jimmy's the best. So what else can a mother ask for but to see her daughter start this new chapter with the love of her life? Even though as a kid I was dreaming about what I thought was much cooler things, I can say I've been thinking about this day since I met you. I would like to think we always knew there was a chance we would be standing here today. From the time I gave you my first hint when I said, if only these keys open the same door. <laughs> However, one thing I had not planned for was that our keys will not open, op open up the same door, but it would open up the same door six different times <laughs> in the three and a half years we've been together. <laughs> Clearly, we are not afraid to pack up our lives to better our lives together. We have qu quickly learned that wherever we are, we will always be home. I promise to always support you in every decision you make, even though I'll be doing my own in-depth research for months. I promise to call truth to every argument, even if we both know my idea is better. I promise to stand by you today, tomorrow, and always, as we are stronger together than apart. And most importantly, I promise to be your best friend for the rest of our lives. James, I'm not gonna lie and say I haven't been dreaming of this day since I was about seven years old, probably even before that. Ever since I watched all the Spanish novelas with my grandmas, 
all of the storylines had one common ending. The couples would have the most magical wedding day. Something very similar to today. Today, we write our own love novella. Even though I always dreamt of my wedding day, never in a million years did I think I would be marrying someone as perfect as you. Since the very first day I met you, you've exceeded every expectation I've ever had of my Prince Charming. Since the day we met, we've quite literally been together 24 seven. If my math is correct, we spent about two million minutes together. And even after all that time, I still can't seem to find anything about you that annoys me. Not even a little bit. Well, sometimes a little golf. James, you are the answer to every prayer. I'll spend the rest of my life thanking God for giving us this life. One last thing. Tucker sends his apologies for not being able to be here today. But he too promised to love you unconditionally to the, for the rest of his life. I give you this ring as a symbol of my commitment and devotion. I choose you to share my life's journeys. I choose you to share my life's journeys. I pledge to love you today, tomorrow, and always with no take backs. I promise to love you today, tomorrow, and always with no take backs. Family and friends, I present to you Mr. and Mrs. Forrester. James, you may now kiss your beautiful bride. <laughs> Thanks first. You're a superstar. Breaking on the scene.